Hi, I'm Todd Henderson. Today we're going to install the Gator HR1 hard rolling cover on this 2017 Ram 2500 with a 6.4 bed. Now this is the same install on most trucks. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to start with our passenger side rail. To locate your passenger side rail, find the rail that has this strap that's coming off about a foot from uh, the where it meets the cab of the truck. Um, now your uh, Velcro is going to be to the outside, that strap is going to be to the inside. Uh, you're also going to have a flange that hangs off the edge of the rail about a quarter inch. Um, that flange is actually going to rest on top of your bed cap. You're going to line this up between the bulkhead and the tailgate uh, and we're going to center that in and then uh, uh, drop it down on top of the bed cap. Now one other thing I'm going to do to make things easier while I'm working, I'm just going to take a squeeze clamp. I'm going to attach that to the rail hold that in place while I'm working. All right, now I've got the bolt loosened up on the clamp. On this particular bed, uh, I'm going to have the, the, the clamp go down into the lower uh, clamp groove. Now, uh, speaking of the grooves, you're going to have grooves on the clamp here. Those are going to match up to the grooves that are in the rail. So I'm going to set this up uh, to where we're biting down between the rail and the bed cap. Um, those grooves need to mate up perfectly, and then as I tighten this down by hand, that's going to draw the clamp together. I got it hand tight, now I'm going to take a half inch wrench or socket and I'm going to get it to where it's just starting to bite down. Once I do that, I'm going to push down on the rail, make sure it's seated completely against the bed cap, and then I'm going to continue to tighten down this clamp. Now for the second clamp, we're going to install it the exact same way. We're just going to move about midway down on the bed. Make sure you don't have any obstructions getting in your way. Slide that up into the rail. Make sure it's made it up perfectly. Push down on that rail and then tighten it up first by hand. And then with your half inch wrench or socket, we can go ahead and tighten that down. All right, so for the last clamp, we're going to install this the exact same way. You want to try to get it as close to the tailgate as possible. Um, so we're, again, we're going to go right up into that clamp or in, into the, uh, the grooves on the rail. Uh, make sure we get that hand tight first. Also make sure that rail is pushed all the way down. We want to make sure on every clamp the, the flange on that rail is all the way down to the bed cap before we tighten it down. Then again, half inch wrench or ratchet, we can tighten it down. All right, now we're going to take our cover and we're going to rest it on the rails. Um, now you'll notice you got some plastic inserts that go into the rail right here those are going to go all the way to the edge of the cover. Once those are set in place, we're going to take, we're going to roll this in. This end is what actually goes next to the cab. Now, if you notice, you've got a little locator screw that's right here. That locator screw is actually going to drop down into this oval hole on the rail. So what we have to do is we have to uh, slide the entire cover forward. All right, so when the locator screw drops down into the oval hole, we can slide the lock into place and do that on both sides. Now if you want to drive with the cover fully open and locked in place, you just take your cinch strap, and hook it around, go into the hoop, and then cinch it down to position. Do up both sides, you're good to drive down the road. From this position, we're just going to roll it all the way to the tailgate. Once we get to the tailgate, push it all the way down, let the slam latches latch into position. Now the HR1 can be closed with the tailgate closing onto the seal or for the seal to close on top of the tailgate. Well, that concludes the installation. If you have any questions, call the experts. We're here to help you out.